Welcome back to the site to Banathy's 100% walkthrough on the PlayStation 3. This is part 46 and at this part we're going to do two missions. The first one that we're going to start off with is actually a Sly Bentley team up mission. So we're going to go to the top of this balloon and then we're going to start that first mission just there. Happy to have you along, Bentley. What do you need me to do? Pickpocket the guard's keys to the engine room. Once you've got the door open, I'll take over. Okay, you should take your position. It's not gonna take me long to lighten these guys of their keys. Okay, to take out the first out of four um, of the, those uh, control rooms, we are first of all going to steal five keys from five guards to open the door so Bentley can go in basically because we're going to destroy that control room and basically all four of those these missions that you that they that are open for you right now are just about destroying the um, control rooms and that's something that we actually have to do to defeat clockwork that is the only way we can do it so we have to do that right now we've got one out of five keys which is not great but we're going to do that anyways. Great. Great. It's great. Yeah, it's great. Uh, what am I talking about? And what happened there? What the... How? Okay, what's going on? Jump up. Okay, just jump down there then. Okay, what happened there? I, I don't know. It's very, very weird. But here's the second guard that we're going to steal the ear. His key from that's the second out of five engine room keys. Three more to go, not that much. But yeah, in this part and the next part, I'm going to have two missions. You can probably see at the length of this video is 18 minutes, and that and that is two missions in it. So the missions are a bit long. So yes, but I'm just going to put two missions in one part because. I'm trying to get this walkthrough done now. It's been really great doing this walkthrough. It's been one of my favorites, but I'm trying to get it done now because I've got other plans to what to do and stuff. So I have to get it done, get it done because I've got other plans, stuff to do, stuff that hopefully you guys will like. I hope, I hope so, anyways, because I got a lot of nice plans coming up, and I really, really, really want to start them now, but I can't start them now because I'm doing two walkthroughs at the same time now, and I don't like doing two walkthroughs at at the same time. I really just want to do one walkthrough at a time because I think that's much more enjoyable for me, and because I don't have to like be as stressed as I normally am when I'm doing two walkthroughs at a time because I really don't want to do two walkthroughs at a time anymore. I probably will later, but I really just want to finish slide two now and Ratchet and Clank. Well, actually, I want to just finish slide two, then I just have Ratchet and Clank, so then I want to finish that and then I want to go on to other things because I just want to do one walkthrough at a time right now one sequence at a time that was a bad reference I, I think a lot of people are not going to get that reference but I'm not going to like tell you it anyways because yeah sorry about that little cut from back there it's just a little cut sorry about that little cut but yeah we've got four out of five engine room keys now there's the fifth guard and I can't talk today today the fifth guard. Let's steal his key. There we go, with the fifth engine room key, and that was a strange noise. Yeah, now we... Oh, I could just have jumped up from there. That was stupid. Annoying. I could just jumped on it from there, actually. But, that's all five keys, so we'll make our way up to the engine room to open it. Basically, so Bentley can get through. Easy as that. Yeah, that's how it works. Seriously. 
I fell down. That is so stupid. And yeah, I haven't done much at like I just put the clips onto Sony Vegas right now and I haven't edited much because I didn't feel like it, so sorry. Cause so you're going to get some fails in this part. I'm sorry. Okay, Bentley, you're on. So this is Bentley's part of the mission. This you have to uh, get all these thingies out of the way, and to do that, if you uh, shoot the one that is like two of them are connected together, and if you shoot one of them, you have to destroy the other one, the second one, to do this. So if you hit another one that you aren't supposed to hit, you're going to like fail. That that pretty much didn't make sense at that. I failed one time at this, which I normally don't do. I don't fail at this at all, but I did uh, this time around, so I'm sorry about that. Because it's probably really annoying. I think I failed here. No, I don't. That's great. I think I failed here. No, I don't fail there. I think I failed here. No, I don't fail. <laughs> I should stop talking now. Okay, I failed here. There, I failed. That was stupid. Yeah, let's try that one more time. Ball, I know that I'm going to do it this time around though. So let's try and do it. And I just noticed now that the door is open. Like the front door for my house. I just noticed that it's open right now because you can see out the window. I'm going to close that afterwards because I don't want tourists to come inside and scare the heck out of me. Yeah, I don't want that because if I live in a touristy place, if you didn't know. I think I've said that before. So yeah, in case you didn't know, now you know if you need to know, which you don't need to know. So I should stop talking right now about that because it's really stupid, but I always talk about the stupid things and I never talk about what I'm supposed to talk about. That's the problem with me. And you better get used to it because this is going to be a long ride. And that was stupid as well, so I should have just stopped with that. So I'm nearly done with uh, um, and getting all these away, destroying all of them. Four more of these uh, connected things so three more that are connected together hopefully soon two more that are connected together and this is the second one so yeah hit it hit it and I didn't hit it that's stupid what do you okay one more this is the last one let's see it be done so now we need to go up to the second level. This is a little bit uh, different from the top. Now we're supposed to bomb these orange things that you can see on the floor. I basically put out two bombs at a time. And it's probably really, really loud now, so you probably can't hear my commentary. But yeah, destroy all these on the floor and you'll have the mission completed. So that's great. One out of two missions done. Let's see it be done. Uh, it's not done yet. <laughs> so you're going to go over to that room which is open now and pull the lever. So that is the Sly Bentley Tag Mission. I don't think there are any more of those. No, I don't think so. No, I don't. No, 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 no. So now we're going to go out of this control room and then we're going to go and make our way to the second mission that we're going to do in this part. So let's just get out of the control room. And the mission that we're going to do now is a Bentley mission. This is this is really the order that you really suppose no. You, there's no order of which mission that you're supposed to do, never in the Sly games, so I don't know why I was going to say that. 
but it's not an order. Never, it's never an order for the missions in the Sly games. Never. So now you know that. Thankfully. Oh god, those things that pop out of the eggs are pretty annoying. I don't like them at all. They're really annoying when they're bugging you. Take him out. And he's after me. But let's go over to the indicator. Right over there. And then we can start the Bentley Murray tag mission. That's one of the engines that needs to be disabled. I won't lie to you, Murray. This is going to be a tough job that requires both our skills. My skills? Okay, Bentley, if you say so. First, I'll need to hack the station's controlling access to the engine room. Then, Murray, you'll need to head inside and use your muscle to finish the job. The Murray will be ready to go. So, now, first of all, to get into the control room, you have to hack three computers that are scattered around the area and the first one is located right over there it's very close you can see it from here so let's just go over and hack that computer right now so I need to introduce something to hacking now you can see that the bullets or the things that Bentley shoots in the hacking um, bumps uh, off the walls and of everything that it hits so this is really cool. This is really helpful. This is a very, very good thing introduced hacking. I think you got this in Sly 3 as well, so. Now I just said that there's hacking in Sly 3, which is not good. But yeah, it's not going to be that long until we do that game, probably. Let's stop talking about that. But this is really good for hacking. I really, really like it. And I think it's going to stay with the game's so hopefully it's in Sly Cooper Thieves in time as well because that would be very helpful because I really need this to be good at hacking because I'm nor normally not good at hacking. But that is actually the first out of three computers done. Let's just get into that green port. Is it called port? I'm just going to call it port. So let's get into the third port and then we're done with the first out of three computers. We're going to make our way over to the second one right now, which is located over there. So we'll go up here. And a guard noticed me, which is not good. I hate it when guards notice notices me because I just run, I guess. Just run, I just don't care stopping. And now I'm really, really hungry. I really want to get some food now. I want some food, so that is why I... We didn't really be bothered to edit that much because I just want this part to be done and eat. That is really bad of me saying because I'm doing commentary now and it's one of my videos. And I shouldn't say that I just want it to be done because it is very important that I do the videos like perfectly. But this time I haven't, so just stick with that basically. That's just how it's going to be. Now we're doing the second hacking. And something is different for something which is different for the hacking in episode eight is that uh, the hacking levels are not the same. Like d um, before, they've been the same, just that they've got harder and harder. But now they're just completely different designs on them, which is I, I like. I'll, I really like that because I don't like things to be the same. I would. I like originality. So. I think that's very great. Into the second port. Now we're just going to go over there and destroy those nodes or those balls. And get into the third green port so we can complete the second out of three hacking computers, stuff, things and stuff. That's stuff. That's how I explain it. And that's the second one. So we're going to make our way over to the third one, which is located all the way over there. It's not that long, really, but yeah, we're going to make our way over there now. It's not that long, actually. It's just over here, and that is the third and final one. You can see clockwork there. There's clock claw. You can see her there. She got lights too, so she's looking for us. 
So that's very scary. Clock Claw is born, I guess. And you can see that iron door or metal door. That's actually the door that Mary's going to go through. This one is actually very hard for me because uh, the, the nodes or the enemies in this section just keeps coming and keeps coming. Like this. You have to be really careful when you're doing this because they will try to kill you basically. Like they always do. But this time around I found it to be really easy and I really did complete it really fast. Which I'm quite happy about. So yeah, I'm happy about that. As you can see I'm doing this really fast so let's get into the green port and be done with that king. So now we're inside the second control room. Now that we're Mary, you just have to pull up all these that are scattered around here. So we're going to do that. Now we actually got a company with the guards that are coming to try and kill us. That's not good. Not good at all. And now they're actually going to hit me because I was strange and I just didn't care about him and just ran to the lifting thingy. So you should take them out. Really, you should. So, this is the third one that we're um, lifting up. And my hair is a mess now, which is annoying for me. It's not annoying for you guys because I'm not on camera. So, yeah. Thankfully, I'm not on camera because I look like shit today. My hair is shit. My makeup is shit. My outfit is shit. My skin is shit. And, and I just... And I just thought now that I'm, I've been swearing. Sorry, sorry about the swearing. Really sorry. Sorry to the young people watching this. I shouldn't be saying that now that I'm 15 years old. I'm young as well, so I should stop saying that other people are young instead of me because I'm young myself. So I should stop with that, shouldn't I? Yes, I should. Let's get up to the second level. Now you just need to belly flop onto these buttons right here that are on top of these things that we just lifted and the things that we lifted will fall down on the ground and be destroyed and that is how we get the door open to the lever that we have to pull to destroy the control room basically that's how we do it. not destroy the control room but um, make it different <laughs> like do it what we want to do with it I guess. Another engine bites the dust. Mission completed or job completed. Now we're done with the two missions for this part. So I hope I will you will join me in part 47 when I will do the two other missions that are that I have to do in this episode 8. So I'll see you in part 47. See ya!